Now, the reason why this is a dream come true was that towards the end of Daddy's life, you saw that Daddy is a dancer. But Daddy doesn't just dance, you know, there's a yoga master that said, we are the the cooker, you want to do Daddy didn't just dance to anything, he danced unto the Lord. Towards the end of his life, <laughs> the ministry of this young man ministered to Daddy. Because maybe some of you are already knowing who I'm talking about. You see, this person has a way of connecting the old and the young. Those songs that I knew with my dad, and I'm going to still talk about that, the songs that I knew with my dad, he would sing them and he would play them to my dad. Even before he got into a place that he could not even respond, he would hear the song, Mommy knows, and in the house, what would they be doing? Dancing. Dancing. Especially, do 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 you know? Also, what my mother invited me. All 
these songs, I just came from Turkey. I was in Abu Dhabi the other week. I go around the world singing songs that we used to sing in morning devotion. Do you understand? And people hear them. This is not the first time I'm hearing. That's why when you hear my, my events, I'm always saying I'm not a prophet. Because the kind of testimonies people come to me, and I know that it is not my dream, you know. So I, and I connect with because it was part of what I was going to come to say that in case anybody is here, yeah. Obviously, Daniel was a great person, so he might be sad. But do not be sad. Let me give you some points. First of all, this is this points like this is a perfect opportunity for us to fully appreciate the gift that Jesus Christ gave us. Because naturally, if there was no Jesus Christ, then everybody should be weeping because such a great person is gone, and you never see him again. But the gift of Jesus made it such that he has just gone to the rest. Then. So I never met him, I saw videos, yeah? And there are some pointers I want to let you know in the videos. First of all, the Bible says in the presence of God, there is fullness of joy. I want you to know there's a difference between joy and happiness. Yeah. Happiness is seasonal, depends on what happens to you. If good things happen to you, you become happy. If bad things happen, you become sad. But the joy of God is constant. Yes. That's why those three Hebrews, they were in fire, they were glowing. Daniel was in the day, he was happy because God's presence was with him. Then the Bible says, Though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. That thing is something we always say and we do not fully understand. Valley, first of all, is a, is a horrible place to be, it's the lowest place you can be. He now says, Shadow. That is his dark. Who can get the shadow? Death. Ah. But still, you say, You fear no evil. Because you are with me. Do you know why? Because in his presence, there is fullness of joy. The Bible in the book of Revelation says, um, you know, God sits on the throne, the four beings in front of you, the 24 elders, they bow, you know, and they say, day and night, they praise him. And that is one thing I found in Daniel. So, in case you are sad, that is upstairs looking at you now. I know we have a list of songs we want you to sing, but let's start from this note. The first song he's singing and looking at you is Ijayo Kwi Ogunzi
that he is landing in heaven in the presence of the Almighty. He's joining the 24 elders. He's teaching them the dance step he used to dance like this.
giving us a message. Most of whom are wanting to go on in.
Because if you have slept through the old prayer session, you will wake up during this time. And it is ba 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 ba
photograph in front right now with Ima before he leaves.